So he might just be a gun enthusiast who's got glaucoma, right? Yes, sir. That's true. But I mean, yeah. more than what's up, everybody? This is a quick clip. When I was in Ocala, March of this year, 2022, and them dirty tyrants, when a stereotype, worry about my firearm instead of my injury. Uh, y'all stay tuned. Feel like I'm gonna go fishing in y'all city next. Like, share, and subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Let's go. Check what this is right here. Nothing in those bags over there? No, this is all tattoo stuff. Okay. I'm gonna have to see what this is. Do you have a plastic bag in your car? Or a paper bag? Huh? Yes. Yeah, okay. And can you grab two? Because what I'm gonna do, whenever I get there, I'm gonna put his firearm in that trunk and he'll have to put it back together okay. once we leave. Or well, however. It don't have to be big, just to put the firearm in the bag to put in the truck once we leave. back to uh, assault rifle for MFT 1048. Well, that's the serial number. That's the serial number. I'm thinking. We're going to see. Because if not, just stay 1012 real quick with that. Uh, so pick the, here, do this. You can pick this firearm in one bag and then the bullet in magazine in another. Rounds. 
What's that? It's in the bump stop. It's near towards the pump stop area. It's near towards the pump stop area. Temple, is it on the stock itself? Temple. Yeah, well, that's going to be the stock brand. The serial number should be somewhere near the magazine release. You say the serial number should be near the magazine release. 23, I'll try to check again. I don't know if he stretched off the serial number or not. All right, stay 1012 and have Sarge come over here yeah. with uh, that guy. He builds it, like I said. He builds it? Yeah. Well, I'm still going to take lots of photos. Give me a second. Let me let me go off of us. Okay. So, as you see, the salt rifle back there. Uh, on the back seat. Yeah. Uh, again, whole box of ammo back here. Okay. Um, is he allowed to have this? So, is that against I, the law? I don't, I don't know. Did he say he had a CWP? He does not, but. Concealed. Was it concealed on him? No, it was inside the uh, bag right. right there. What about that one? Is that concealed on him? No, that was was on a uh, uh, passenger front okay. seat. The other handgun was in the middle so console. So it was just being transported. Yeah. Right? Uh, okay. I got this. Definitely do it. FIR. My only issue is with this, this is my, like, first ever having something like this one where it's narcotics but he has a medical marijuana cart so and he says transport. yeah right. so dispatch ended up saying it has been renewed and everything and okay. he got a refill on yesterday which is okay. on there so all that is validated but the thing is isn't it i thought if i'm not mistaken i'm gonna have to double check on that um with him having the cw not cwp the medical cart mm -hmm. and him having guns with it, I thought that is that. Well, can do we be. have any dope in the car? No, just only the medical. Medical. No I just no marijuana in the car. Though. No, it is. It's inside the container. It's like three. In separate. the prescription, man. Yeah, in yeah. it. Exactly. So that's the thing. And this, real quick, I'm gonna bring it to you. He saw you pull that out. He said that is uh, protein powder. Okay. Like yeah. yeah, I mean that would be the cleanest yeah. dope I ever saw. I that was dope, right? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'll put it back. But yeah, that's that's just all the question I had. I was just like, this is pretty, you know. Well, come, come here for me. Uh, okay. What do, you, what do you think this dude is doing? <laughs> that's a pretty rough one to say right you now. You want to know what I think he yeah, does? I think he obtains marijuana legally, and he drives around and he sells it illegally, and he carries guns just in case to protect himself and protect his stash, 
This is his mobile dispensary, yes, but he doesn't have marijuana on him right now, at least not in a quantity that he would usually drive around and sell. So we caught him riding clean mm -hmm. because he was in a car accident. But there's no other reason for somebody to have an AR with a pistol grip and a oh, yeah. firearm in the vehicle. And with a laser in there, too. So he might just be a gun enthusiast who's got glaucoma, right? Yes, sir. That's true. But... I mean, definitely. More, more reasonably, he's a an entrepreneur of sorts who needs to cover his own. You know what? When he's out running business. Yes, sir. Okay, so I think you're right. Pull a separate case number, write up the FIR. I would take a photograph of that AR. Oh, I did. And I would take a photograph of this vehicle, and I would include both of them, and then I'll kick this out to you, Desk. This is going to be something they'd be interested in more than, uh, more than yeah. Want. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. But, I'm gonna put uh, all that back in. Put all I'll that stick in. around just so you can kind of tell them what's happening. Is he gonna be able to get off of this? Yeah, he'll be all right. Be I'm a, Did I'm you a, get the serial number on that other pistol? Yeah, on the pistol I got. That one's good. Number. Okay. So everything okay. came back. To okay. Now. All right. I'm just put all his that stuff in the trunk. Okay. Keep it away from him. Okay. That stuff in the trunk. Okay. Keep it away from him. Are you going to drive this from here, or are you going to give him a ride? Throw it down three. Do you have that uh, handgun signal zero, zero number in the call? Could you pull me a separate call and open up a 13 incident? And I'm going to use that as an FIR and place the signal zeros in that call, please. Sir. Oh, he scared me. I'm sorry. 54, he advised that he makes handguns as well, or firearms. 1048. Protein yeah, that's what he said. Yeah. This was in there too? Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. Okay, all it's in the trunk, Will. see the firearm, I put the firearm, both bags in the right side corner, then his other one over here.